Hey, this is a quick video on how to mount a logical partition in Ubuntu, or in this case, the SIF workstation. So to do that, first you start off by um, navigating to the directory where the image is stored. And in this case, my the name of my image is ext3-img-kw-1.dd. Um, and if you're not sure if this is a logical partition or not, or what the file system or this partition is, you can find that out by using the file command. So just type file, and then the name of the partition, and then you get the you, you then you find out the uh, what type of file system this um, image is. So in this case, it is the ext3 file system and you're going to need this for the mount command so first thing you need to know is um, when you want to mount you have to be a super user so you need to elevate your privileges so you just sudo su alright now you're ready to mount so to mount it just type mount dash t this is the type of file system that you want to mount that the type of file system that the image is in this case is ext3 and then you want to specify your options and in this particular instance I want to use read only and I want to use the loopback device and then you specify the name of the image and then you specify where you want the image where you want the mount where you want the image to be mounted to so I want it to be in the mount directory and the ext3 directory and you just press enter and there you have it and just to be sure that it mounts it, you can just ls to the directory to see what's inside there. And in this case, I got three files in the lost lost and found directory. And to unmount it, you just use u mount and just specify the directory where you want to be what you want to be unmounted. So in this case, the directory where you just mounted it to. and to prove that it's unmounted there you go that's how you mount a logical partition